Hello everyone out there and welcome back to our channel. This is Cold Fire. And I'm Kit. And today we are going to be reacting to a special request from Joe. And um, this is the link I clicked on in here. So I'm hoping that this is the one that um, you wanted us to react to. So I think the links are working now. So we'll be able to react to them. And uh, we do appreciate the kind words that you sent asking if we were okay from the flu and everything it was a rough one but we made it through the wilderness <laughs> like madonna said well, apparently and apparently you wanted me in on this one um i don't know who tori is so, but yeah but you asked me if he knew who tori was and i've reacted to one or two, two of her songs before she's got a gorgeous voice okay and he just wanted to okay. you to listen just to this keep one. in mind don't get mad i'm very honest on my opinion <laughs> so but remember that's exactly it it's just an opinion it's not fact yes it's just an opinion i i think you'll like her so she she's got a very is this, is this her yes okay she is a uh, uh she's been around for like 20 years so to speak mm. So what, she's been singing since she was one? Because she only looks like she, 21 years old. <laughs> she covers a lot of artist songs. Okay. She's she's like a cover artist. And um, so we're going to see what it is. Okay. But it says, um, how did the Carpenters get that famous harmony sound tutorial for We've Only but Just Begun? So, I thought it was a Georgia thing. But I don't know. Okay. Let's see. So the Carpenters were by no means the first people to ever overdub in the music industry. They were heavily inspired by Les Paul and Mary Ford, but their techniques that they used in the studio were so innovative. And thanks to co-author of The Carpenters The Musical Legacy, Chris May, um, he recently uploaded a video on YouTube that showcased all the layers of the harmonies in We've Only Just Begun. And I thought just for fun that I would kind of recreate that process and see if I can get it to sound um, like the Carpenter's sound that we all know and love. So first in this process, I'm gonna start with the outer layers of the chord in the harmony. Um, so I'm gonna be doing both Richard and Karen's parts. <laughs> so the Carpenter's for this song, We've Only Just Begun, tripled all of the parts of the harmonies that they sung. And Pro Tools is giving me quite a hard time today, so I'm just going to use my good old Tascam 24 track. The Carpenters use tape, so this is really the closest thing that I have. A kiss for luck and we're on our way. We've only begun. And now for the two inner parts of the chord. Begun, we've only begun. So what I've done is I've tripled each of those parts that I just recorded. And now I'm gonna listen to the final product. So just for reference, I'm going to show each of these parts separately. So this is the outer layer of the chord. It's for luck and we're on our way. Wow. We've only and this is that inner part of the chord. And now this is my first time listening back, is the whole thing put together. Oh my god. I'm gonna cry, I just got goosebumps. One more time. Joe, I hope that was the one that um, you were looking for. That was awesome. 
Can how she can just sit there and do that by herself. I'm not tech savvy at all. No. I wouldn't even know where to begin to do something like that. Impressive. Not to mention I can't even sing. But Dude, you can't, she you matched can't really she know. matched up his and uh, um, Richard and Karen's mm -hmm. voice. That that's that's a feat. That was I I've never actually listened to anything like that before, so I, I don't have a reaction. Um, I don't know how to react to it. Um, but what what did you think of her? How she? I mean, her her just her just voice sounds acapella. nice, just like just like you know, um, just like the Carpenters or Carpenter, whatever they want to go by. And he does um, like the Carpenters. I just, I don't it's like, just he can't stay awake through them. They're more. I like their their vocals. It's their music I can't stand. I mean, it's like Patsy Cline. I love Patsy Cline, but he can only take so much of her because she's so serene. There are some of she's her songs. So hypnotic. I'll, there are some of her songs I like because it's it's upbeat. I, again, I'm more of an upbeat music person. And but I just thought it was fascinating. You know, how she like I said. It. The Carpenters, I like their vocals. I can't stand most of their music because it's so. Um, well, that was the seventies yeah. for you. I know that everything and was supposed to be so. Yeah. Because remember, the Carpenters that's were why great. I, that's why I was born in the late seventies. The reason um, why I think I, I like the Carpenters so much is because they were very big on supporting veterans. Yes, I know that. Returning from war. And having that, all these you know, your, amputees and, and mental stress. That and your brother liked them, yes. too. So. Um, by the way, Joe, I don't know if you know that um, my oldest brother, Kevin, who was also gay, he was with his partner for 29 years, and he absolutely worshipped the ground that the Carpenters walked on. But he was murdered in uh, Wilton Manors. Him and his partner at the time were murdered by his caretaker because he had a kidney pancreas transplant and he survived that and he needed a caretaker and the caretaker um, shot them to death on Christmas Eve of 2000. I have not, uh, I did see that you asked us to react to Georgia so I will try to see if the other link that come through has Georgia on it and react to that. But I do hope that you enjoyed our reaction to this. Um, it was very unique. It, it was, uh, I don't know how she could put um, hers, Richard's, and Karen's voices to sound like that. I, it's, it's absolutely phenomenal. I know what you're talking about. It, it's out of this world. But I do wish you love and happiness and wellness down there. And um, stick with us. Um, we love you. And like I said, thanks again for all the warm wishes and, you know, the commentary and the suggestions that you give us. Love you. Bye-bye.